Hello, what's happening? What's up, Grubermod, Got Six, Rainbow Derp, Sky the Dog, Bunny Mountain. I was eyed. Bunny Mountain, good to see you. Thanks for bringing James. Hope everybody's having a great day today. We're going to be continuing the Darkest Dungeon today. I want to get some of the champion bosses done. Maybe another level of the Darkest Dungeon completed. We'll see. Up mucking a lot, Silver Moron, Spambo Jambo, Broken Comfort, Gray Fox 17, Goofling, Big Old Pete, Cerebus, Bunny Wild. What a great day. What's up, Pinball Wiz? Kazaki, Grim, Pixel Fusion, Blue Nuke, Dapper. Sothonic One, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the 22 consecutive months. So, Killer Elite, Blue Nuke. Bio Lanzer, Sothonic One, Cerber QC, Flipside, Lazy, Jay Lang, My Dad Martin, Issa Rune. Let's hop into this party, shall we? Let's get it going. Well, we have Tier 1 of the Darkest Dungeon done currently. I have several champion bosses left to defeat on this playthrough, as well as three more tiers of the Darkest Dungeon. Huntworthy, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 14 consecutive months. All Much my love. Life, I could feel an insistent gnawing in the back oh, of my Oh, what do you mind. got going on? Well, it was a yearning of Keep it damper. Excuse me. The Gray Fox, 17. Thank you for keeping it damper for the past 13 months, sir. Much love. Let's send Corotonic to the Abbey here. Let's see. I got quite a few level 6 characters. We definitely have the capability to go to the Darkest Dungeon now, which I think I'm going to try. Keep it dapper. Let's see what else we got. Mr. Shivers 13, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate these six consecutive months. Much love. What do we got for lower level characters? Not great. What's in our stagecoach? Got a healer? No healer. Well, the cultist is kind of a healer. I don't think I want to hop right into the darkest dungeon. I think I want to do something else first. I need to get Cove leveled up so we can get the bosses there. Um, okay, we got Swine God, and we have to have something else in there too. I guess the real question for me right now, R. Somner, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 26 consecutive months. The real Hoodie, 4141, thank you for the three consecutive months. Much love, man. The real question for you right now is, do I want to grind out some of the uh, harder missions to unlock the boss fights, or do I just want to go for the Darkest Dungeon? It's a tough decision. I do want to do uh, New Game Plus still, so I kind of want to complete the Darkest Dungeon, but that's sketchy. So if we're gonna take a level full level party out, we'd have to take. Do I even have? Okay, I gotta get Fisselbert up to level up to level six. Because on this next tier of the darkest dungeon, we have to equip this trinket right here. Three of these. Where are my torches at? Here we go. So I guess we're not quite there yet. All right. Let's go to the blacksmith and get him leveled up. Oh, the monies, that hurts. Okay, we got most everybody to level 5 now. That's good. So, last few remaining people that need level 5 over here. Not too shabby. Does anybody know what the maximum level is for each dungeon? My roster is looking pretty good. Uh, it's just going to be a matter of completing the remaining tasks and then heading into the Darkest Dungeon. Uh, I think big thing for the Darkest Dungeon is going to be uh, getting my skills where I want them to be. Doing quite well tonight, Fancy Fishy. Thank you. What's up, Rowan? The weird mutated person's coming as an effect of having done the Darkest Dungeon. 
Seven, you think? None have gone past seven? Okay, that would make sense. I believe we have all the wield bosses done. That's pretty good. I think we can probably kill the swine god. The swine, uh, swine's not an easy fight by any means, but I think bolster should be effective. It was effective for, uh, other missions. Yeah, let's try to kill the swine god. Keep it dapper. Dravenos, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the four consecutive months. Much love. Uh, it's always always a struggle when you first uh, start out here trying to figure out what exactly you want to do Okay, let's go bring him here. We'll bring So my only level okay, let's just spend the money to upgrade them Okay, skills aren't on point yet. We'll get at least the heals up to where they need to be. So, are you okay? No, you're not okay. I'm thinking Noxious Blast is going to be really good versus the boss. Alright, let's sell a few trinkets too. Use Men's Trauma to sell for? Nah, not enough. Damage versus Eldritch is going to be very good for the next dungeon. Maybe I'll take a level 6 healer this time around. Yeah, it's almost overwhelming, Mauro. I think that's uh, I think that's a good way to put it. But you get there eventually. You just had to make some tough decisions. Okay, so we'll take him. We'll take. Uh... I want to get multiple people leveled up here if possible. You know what? We'll take we'll take a level four armor into this boss fight. I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but it is my healer. Let's check what the cost is to upgrade that. It might be less than the Man at Arms. It's not. Well, fudge. Alright, so we're going to take a level 6 healer this time. Because I'm not quite. I don't have quite enough money to level them up. So we'll take him. We'll take. The level 5 Crusader. And then we'll take. Level 6 Plague Doctor. Oh, I guess you're set up. We can we can take you. We still have uh, two fully level level 6 healers when we do go into the Darkest Dungeon, so feeling pretty good about that. But I need to get a Man at Arms uh, up for at least this portion. We can afford to take a Hellion into the Darkest Dungeon after this one, but I need the guard ability on the Man at Arms to make it work. Okay. Trinket time. Do 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 do. Plus 15% max HP sounds pretty good. That's really nice. Alright, you can take this. Hell, I should sell a couple of these. Or at least one. Definitely don't need three of those. Take that and book a sanity, and then the Vestal will take our standard Vestal trinkets. Melon Balls, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 21 consecutive months. 
What town upgrades do you still need to finish? Well, Sonu, I have, uh, I need to complete the camping skills, uh, and a few things in the sanitarium and tavern, but my guild and blacksmith are fully leveled as is. Alright, here we go. Swine God's gonna be tricky. Um, I think we can do it, though. We got a pretty good damage setup. Uh, Crusader does deceptively high damage. And also we have Noxious Blast to cause the Blight stacking. Alright, so we're going to take a full stack of food. This is one thing I've learned in this game, is that taking more food than you need is good, because you can always use the food to heal yourself. Two shovels. Take 12 torches here. We're basically going to beeline for the boss and, you know, hope it goes well. Thank you for the host, Invicta. Appreciate it two keys in case of super secret room we'll take uh, a couple bandages too that's gonna do it oh well all right then let's try that again I hope my party makeup still uh still there. Yeah, food food for the cause that you pay for at Mount Roth is definitely uh definitely a worthwhile buy. There's always next time. Hopefully it saved where I was, but we'll see. Not a huge loss. At least I have my plan now, so it's not the end of the world. Our family name once so well regarded. Now keep it with that on my decent folk. Okay. Um, who are we taking here? Pash Potato, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the nine consecutive months, sir. Much love. Why am I not getting a holy water this time? Because this is not the party that I set up. I did not take the Hellion, I took the Crusader. I don't even know it's real anymore. Let's just pull everybody out here. Yeah, it saved after I sold the trinket, it looks like. But it messed up my party. Okay, there's that. And you. And you. And you. Max HP and a heal trinket. Give you this. And a heal trinket. You can take this. And let's do heal trinket instead of book of stress this time. I think that's the better choice. Uh, Broken Fist, I've never come across that glitch, no. Keep it dapper. Stanima, thank you for keeping it dapper. Appreciate the three consecutive months. Much love. Two shovels, two keys, two bandages, holy water, 12 torches. Yay, the no glitch this time. I had managed to bring through was brutish. Yeah, it sounds good, stupid. Malroth. Like, good party makeup. Moreover, I'm looking forward to New Game Plus. I'm going to be uh, recruiting people itself. mostly based on traits but and not so much class. Concern. After I also all, think a I less a conservative strategy for New Game Plus will be needed, uh, maximizing damage more so than uh, survivability. A nameless abomination. A testament to my Okay, failures. one, two, it three, four, destroyed. five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we know exactly where our boss is, which is good. This is actually a very favorable layout. More food, okay. All right, what's happening? Okay, the maggots are surprised here, so we definitely want to try to take out the maggots ASAP. What I can do here is go for uh, stun on the guy in the back, which is what I'm going to do. 
I think Occultus power is not being a main healer for your group. I think the power of Occultus is being a synergy character and a backup healer. Um, I really do feel like Occultus has massive potential as a, uh, a secondary healer, but as a main main healer in your group, probably not the best. But I think that in conjunction with like an Arbalist uh, having her heal ability, holy guacamole, that's a big old crit. Four damage for five rounds, eh? That's pretty nasty. See if that works. Resist. Death fair. Keep it stacking. Yeah, Vestal's the best at healing, but doesn't mean that they're the only option. I think specking multiple characters to do heals is really uh, where it is. A lot of characters have self-healing skills, which I did not invest to in this playthrough, and you'd have to if you wanted to have more diverse party makeup. Gilrad23, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the... Uh, oh, sorry, Gilrad, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the 23 consecutive months. Much love to you. Both Handmaster and Abom have self-heal, that's right. And uh, Arbalist also has a multiple character heal. Handmaster has a self-heal. Uh, there's a lot of options for healing. Other than having the tank healer set up that we have right now. May we find victory. Hello, large flesh eater. Yeah, they're surprised. That's good. Um, I think my play here is going to be stunning the back row, hitting the hitting the large corpse eater as much as possible. Of course, he resisted. Um, yeah, we'll just try to take down this large corpse eater. So much so, I'm even going to judgment here. By Rignus, thank you for keeping it damper. Appreciate the two consecutive months. Much love to you. Yeah, indeed. Um, I think especially New Game Plus, the best form of crowd control is going to be death. Specking for very aggressive parties. It's going to be the way to go. All right, he's got 39 HP left. Let's play grenade the back row here. Start that. Uh, start that ticking down. Good resist. Three damage for three rounds. That's okay. We'll uh, we'll go ahead and heal up after this fight a bit. In fact, I may just have the Plague Doctor heal these two guys. Very good. All right, I think party heal here seems appropriate. We'll go Battlefield Medicine here. That'll cure both of us. Oh, this fight lasted way too long. Good crit. Monstrous size has no intrinsic merit. Unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. A virtue. Press disadvantage. Give them no quarter. No quarter. Let me check something here. There we go. All right. Let's just uh, let's just cure him of blight. Okay. The that fight didn't go great, but it certainly could have gotten worse. Blossoms. Cool. That's actually pretty nice. <laughs> what are we gonna drop here? I guess we'll eat this food. Seems good. Three for one more round, not worth getting rid of that. Yeah, we're set up for a nice party heal. Hello, Mr. Collector. 
What's happening? Keep it dapper. Why the collector? He's just gonna cause me a lot of stress. All right, well, Holy Lance forward and take him out. I don't know, man. Maybe I'll bolster here? Yeah, that's gonna be a more extended fight. We're gonna go for a more defensive setup here. I can bleed him out with, uh, well, plague grenades. Unfortunately, the stress damage is real here. Yeah, that's a good buff. We're gonna go, we're gonna go way defensive here. All right, now we can go Judgment. I found the best strat for this fight, in my opinion, is just try to kill the Collector as soon as possible. Yeah, a Collector is not a fun fellow. Holy crap, is a 29 crit. The Collector is definitely not what you want to see on your way to the boss fight. That is for sure. All right, I'm gonna big heal myself. He has enough HP, he can withstand another blow. Uh, her, not so much. All right, you got a pretty massive buff right now, plus 100% damage. Probably worth taking, uh, uh, taking that one out this round. In fact, I'm sure it's worth it. Yeah, Collector on a boss run is not great. We have not camped yet, though, which is very good. The problem is he resummons. He resummons people uh, if you kill them. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. What a bolster again. We'll start getting some dodges in. Eventually. I got the healing to back this. We'll be okay. As long as I can keep stacking that blight damage. Good dodge. Good dodge. Please don't. Oh man, she's not quite on death's door yet. Please let the plague doctor go first. Thank you. Um, all right, let's get this guy down. Yeah, interesting. I might have to switch servers. I've dropped quite a bit of frames tonight. Last time I switched servers, it worked okay. All right, there's one down. We'll leave this guy alive. Nope, because he's going to summon more. All right, Maynard Arms isn't as bad. We got Vestal, Maynard Arms, and one Highwayman. That's... that's workable. Plus, damage on him is not the end of the world. What levels is this party? What's the levels between five and six? Um, yeah, between five and six. What did you get from that? Okay, you're guarded by the man at arms, which is okay, because we're still gonna get. Holy crap, man. We're gonna be okay. Maybe. This is getting nasty real quick. I'm gonna try switching servers after this fight. Thanks for your patience. Come on now. 